as we join now the third fall of the big main event. Tojo Yamamoto and Steve Kovac opposing Don Kent, the Blue Scorpion and their manager Jim Kent. At this point, the falls are even at one apiece. Don Kent starting for his team against Tojo Yamamoto. As I said, the falls are even at this point. Tojo and Don can't lock up. Tojo rolls him over now with an arm bar. Another big crowd on hand here at the Fairgrounds Arena in Nashville, Tennessee. Referee is Tommy Sloan. It's Tojo now applying the pressure to Don Kent's arm. Don Kent, formerly with the world champion Kangaroos. Off the rope, Tojo meets him with the hip lock and back to the arm hold again. Referee Tommy Sloan agrees with Tojo on the tag to Kovac. Kovac continues the pressure to Don Kent's left arm. Jim Kent in his corner, the manager of Don Kent and the Blue Scorpion, seems to be viewing the situation over. Jimmy Kent, usually a factor in any match, seems to be resting at this point. Kent breaks the hold off the ropes and level Steve Kovac and Kovac retaliates and once again applies the arm bar. Jim Kent catches the attention of the referee as a scorpion comes in to kick Kovac away while Tojo in retaliation kicks Kent away and Kovac reapplies his hold. Once again the scorpion in to break things up. Tojo Pulls Kent back down and reapplies the arm bar. Tommy Sloan seems to be having trouble keeping the wrestlers from running in and out of the ring. Don Kent, the forearm smashes to the head of Kovac, whams his head into the knee of the Scorpion. The Blue Scorpion, a big, rugged, masked man from parts unknown, is now has the arm bar applied to him. Referee Tommy Sloan warns Don Kent to stay out of the ring. Kovac continues to apply the pressure to the left arm of the Scorpion. Don Kent now with a choke to Kovac Tojo is ordered back to ring to his side of the ring while the Scorpion and Don Kent take the measure of Steve Kovac. Kovac with a pin, Don Kent kicks him away. The masked Scorpion is dropped by the flying arm scissors and Kovac reapplies the arm bar. The Scorpion trying to break away from the hold is now to his feet as Kovac flips him back over. Don Kent comes in to kick Kovac in the head. Tojo wanting to come in is now tagged by Kovac. Tojo Yamamoto in, applies one of his famous chops to the head of the Scorpion and the Scorpion wants no part of Tojo and immediately tags to Don Kent. Tojo levels Don Kent with a vicious judo chop and now is working on the eyes of Don Kent. Tojo who can be one of the most rugged wrestlers in the ring today. Tojo now chopping the back of Kent. Sends Kent to the ropes. Tojo misses with the with his famous Stomach 
grip. Now slipping in behind Ken on the floor. Another chop to the neck. Two chops to the neck. While Steve Kovac in the ring grabs the Scorpion. Tojo now applying more judo chops. Pure punishment to the head of Steve, of Don Kent. Referee Tommy Sloan also on the floor, trying to restore order. Don Kent returns to the ring and is meet, met immediately by Steve Kovac. Kovac and Don Kent exchanging punches, and Kent is back on the floor again. All four men and the referee are now on the ring. Steve Kovacs head into the ring post. Tojo has a scorpion. Don Kent now. With Steve Kovac. All four men on the floor. Referee Tommy Sloan can't seem to do anything with them. Paired off is Tojo and the scorpion while Don Kent and Steve Kovac climb from underneath the ring. Don Ken applies another vicious right to the head of Steve Kovac. While on the other side, the Scorpion and Tojo are having a few chops and smashes of their own. Jim Kent, the manager of Don Ken and Scorpion, pacing the ring. Don Kent uses a chair on the head of Steve Kovac. As this match is turned into a near ride, as all four men are on the floor, Jim Kent, the manager in the middle of the ring, almost directing Don Kent, encouraging his punishment to the head of Steve Kovac. On the other side, Tojo has a scorpion, and they're now exchanging punches. Blood pouring from the head of Steve Kovac. And he now sends vicious rights to the head of Don Kent. The Scorpion brings a chair into the ring. I don't know who intends to use it. And Steve Kovac now using the shoe of Tojo on the head of Don Kent. Kovac now with Don Kent pinned in the ropes, applying pressure of his own. Jim Kent now. In the middle of the ring seems to be running from Tojo. And Steve Kovac continues with the punishment to Don Kent. Tommy Sloan asking, to, trying to restore order, gets Tojo to return to his corner while the Scorpion, meanwhile, goes back to his corner. Meanwhile in the ring, Steve Kovac, his head covered with blood, staring him about, Tojo holding Don Kent in their corner, the Scorpion trying to get away as he is restrained by Tommy Sloan. Kovac continues the punishment on Don Ken's head. Kovac with a kick to the midsection. Don Kent taking a lot of punishment and he has blood is on the head of Don Kent. The Scorpion in to break up the possible submission hole. He now reapplies it as again the Scorpion, and then he is met. The Scorpion, who seems to have something, now puts it in his mask, and a headbutt to Steve Kovac levels. Don Ken, the count two, three, the match is over. Don Kent and the Scorpion have won this match with the use of an object put in the mask of the scorpion. Tommy Sloan, your referee, did not see exactly what happened, but does, however, raise the hand of Kent and the blue scorpion. Kent, visibly weakened, blood coming from his forehead, did manage to pin. All four men now engaging in, in battle. Jimmy Kent now involved in the battle. All five men now are on the floor. Order can't be restored by the referee. As they continue to fight in the middle of the floor, Kent 
the Scorpion and Jim Kent go to the, the dressing room and dejected. Steve Kovac and Tojo Yamamoto feel helpless. A sure victory was taken away from them by the use of a foreign object in the mask of the Scorpion. The third and deciding, deciding fall won by Don Kent and the Blue Scorpion over the team of Tojo Yamamoto and Steve Kovacs. 